Hello everyone, welcome to Amsterdam and this is yet another opportunity to see the world champions in action. It's France against Belarus. Of course France have the opportunity to get through to the knockout stages. And Belarus, well, they put in a good fight against Portugal. They did lose 2-1. And maybe the scoreline flattered them a bit, but they did show a lot of heart to keep going right to the end. Well, here we are then. A big game for France. A chance to get through to the knockout stages. One change is that Dembele comes in for Mantuidi. But other than that, it's unchanged from the side that put on that terrific display against Germany. That game lived up to everything we wanted it to be. France coming back and winning 2-0. Or 2-1, rather. Belarus, well, they'll be hoping that this can be one of the great, great, great shocks in European football. Of course, Greece and Denmark have won these things, so why not? Also, this is Belarus's first ever tournament, so they got their first ever goal against Portugal. Lights on the club. Good work. Oh, it's off! It's off the post and gone out for a corner. And we nearly had the shock. Goodness me, Belarus with their first attack. And Hugo Lloris was completely caught out and he has got to be thanking his lucky stars that it's not 1-0. Staggering start for them. That's good play from the French, that's what many will expect from his Griezmann. Good save. Uh, in fact, the referee, I think he's going to bring it back here. He's seen something. It is going to be a free kick to the French. It was Mbappe that was just clipped there. And they don't want to be giving away cheap free kicks if they can help it. It's quite some distance out for Griezmann. Helps to chip it to Mbappe who gives it back to him. And now it's with Pavard. To Griezmann. Turns. Chipped into Giroud who was flying for it. This is good play here, here's Pogba. Ooh, the shot is just dragged wide. Here's Dembele. Good pass to Giroud. Oh, there's the goal. And just as I praise Belarus, Olivier Giroud punishes them. And that's the thing with this French side, no matter what. They've got so many ways of unlocking you. It's always going to be difficult for a side like Belarus and this could be a very, very long game of football for them. To think they could have taken the lead, but the French have responded really well. And the thing with this French side is you give them, a, you give them an inch and they will take a mile. Just a really simple play from the back. Brought forward here by Conte. Gives it to Giroud, who just, well, just pings it home. 1-0. Here's Griezmann. Back to Giroud, back to Griezmann. Has a shot, ooh, worth the go. That's a good play here by the French. Here's Mbappe. That's Mendy, good turn, cross comes in. Giroud to target and Giroud misses. Oh, it's still live, oh my word, it's happened. Belarus are continuing to provide shocks. The French are stunned. What a moment, I'm nearly speechless here. Belarus have got an equaliser out of absolutely nothing. They've been outclassed this entire game. They had one brief spell in the first half where they perhaps should have scored and Hugo Lloris has had an absolute howler here. And it's resulted in an easy tap-in. Quite astonishing, 1-1 one, one here. Look at this from Lloris, oh my word. And the French are going to have to do, a, do it all over again. Good play here, here's Mbappe, good little feet. Good strike, that's well saved. Gives it back to him, back to Pavard. Giroud misses the header though. This is a chance. Pogba! Oh my word, it's been missed! Mbappe! 
That may be missing the Euros. Oh, he hit it straight at the Belarus man. He had all the goal in his yearning. And this is one of those where perhaps, perhaps Belarus, it's just their day. Good pass to Griezmann. Gives it back to Mbappe. Pogba's in here. Only as far as Dembele. Oh, he's got in! The strike flew in above the keeper. And France, well, they have gone for it. And they've got the deserved second goal. And Gutter's not happy with himself because he, so, he should have saved that. I'm not sure whether he just lost it in the air for a minute. We'll see here. And France do take the lead again. They front the kitchen sink at them. Look at Dembele here. Strikes it. And, yeah, the keeper should save it. I think it just flew in the air for him. Maybe he thought his teammate had got the tackle in. He might get a better ideal angle here. Oh, no, he should save it, shouldn't he? It's as simple as that. But Dembele, who came in today, gets his goal. Time is almost up here. France look like they're about to get their place in the round of 16. And they do. Well... It was a little bit tr trickier than one would have thought. Belarus have given a lot in these two games. And you just wonder, could they perhaps get a point in their final game? But for France, well, they've done the business. They'll have wanted it a lot easier than what they had. But they're heading to the knockout stages, and I think they may just be the team that goes all the way in Euro 2020.